Manchester United make their much-anticipated Champions League return against Ball on Tuesday evening. Ahead of the Swiss champions' arrival at Old Trafford, Press Association Sport takes a look at some of the talking points. Can Lindelof and Smalling shine? Mourinho on Lindelof he needs a bit of time to adapt to the Premier League but HES a very good player with a lot of potential. MUFCPIC.twitter.com overt Parbic Manchester United at Man UTD September 11, 2017 Phil Jones has impressed for club and country in recent weeks, while Eric Bailey continues to show the promise that led United to sign him from Villarreal last summer. The pair have established themselves at the heart of Jose Mourinho's defence but both are suspended for the Group A opener and Chris Smalling and Victor Lindelof will get a chance to stake their claim for starting berths. Smalling has slipped behind England teammate Jones in the pecking order, while Lindelof's only competitive appearance since his summer move from Benfica was shaky, albeit all conquering Real Madrid were the Super Cup opponents in Scorpia. Red Rom ready for the Champions League. Not the result we wanted but we move on to the next challenge. Delighted to have scored my 150th goal in club football at this club at Man UTD. Pig.twitter.com Jug 3 HQ 9 vs R Lukaku Bowling Early 9 at Romelu Lukaku 9 September 9, 2017 Fresh from netting the 150th goal of his club career in Saturday's 22 draw at Stoke, Romelu Lukaku is now looking to score in the Champions League group stage for the first time. A third-round qualifying appearance against Wales TNS and three playoff matches with Anderlecht have been his the only chances at the continent's top table so far. The big-money summer signing now has the chance for his first group stage goals, having netted nine times in seven outings for club and country this term. Fellaini able to make presence felt. Jose Mourinho provides an update on at Fellaini in his at Champions League press conference. Pick.twitter.com Kami 9J070 Manchester United at Man UTD September 11, 2017 The reoccurrence of a calf complaint meant Marwan Fellaini missed Saturday's 22 draw at Stoke, a match that left Mourinho bemoaning his absence. The 29-year-old is back in contention after returning to training and Mourinho would love to have the Belgian back in his squad. He's a very important player for me, much more important than you can imagine, Mourinho said on Monday. I feel weaker without Fellaini in my squad. It doesn't matter if it is on the pitch or on the bench, so if his condition improves he will be selected because I need him. Another bad day against Baal, at D underscore Digia on FC Basel there is strong team. They're playing at Old Trafford will be extra motivated. It's going to be a tough game, Manchester United at Man UTD September 11, 2017 United do not have particularly fond memories of Baal, having twice tried and failed to beat them at Old Trafford. The Swiss side secured a memorable 11 draw on the first visit in March 2003 and were on the cusp of a famous triumph in September 2011 after recovering from two early Danny Welbeck efforts to go 32 up. Ashley Young's goal at the death saw United snatch a draw but Baal exacted revenge with a 21 win at St. Jacob Park when Sir Alex Ferguson's men needed a point to progress from the group. History bodes well for Baal, but their current form does not. They have gone three domestic matches without a win and suffered a surprise loss to Lausanne Sport at the weekend. Is that Ricky Van Wolf's winkle? The team has arrived in Manchester. Up next training at Old Trafford this evening. FC Basel 1893 UCL pig.twitter.com way one will know FC Basel 1893 N at FC underscore Basel underscore N September 11, 2017 Norwich fans may well rub their eyes in disbelief when the one-time record signing lines up for Baal on Tuesday evening. Van Wolfswinkel arrived to much fanfare in 2013, yet three years and two loan spells later he quietly exited Carrow Road after mustering just two goals in 28 appearances in all competitions. A resurgent season with Vitesse Arnim led Baal to come calling this summer and, while his team has yet to hit the heights expected of them, the Dutch forward has plundered seven goals in as many games.